Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. Today, we are going to start module 2. We will have song lesson part 1. In this lesson, we are going to learn 9 new words and listen to a song and answer some questions. This lesson you will find it in your student book page 19 and in your workbook page 17. Are you ready to start? Let's begin! Grab your student book and open it at module 2, page 19 and pay attention at activity number 1. In this activity, we are going to learn new words about school subjects. But tell me first, what does this phrase mean? Very good. School subjects means things that we learn from school. Let's guess together the first one. Look at the picture. The boy is painting. Which subject you learn how to paint and draw? Excellent! It is art subject. I love painting. Art is my favorite subject. Can you guess the part of his speech of this word art? Yes, it is noun. Good job! Now look at this picture. It is a big hall. Can we exercise in this hall? Of course we can. Now tell me, what subject can we study in this hall? Very good. The subject is PE. In PE, we do sports. Now tell me, what is the part of the speech of the word PE? Very good. It is noun. What about this picture? Look carefully. The boy is trying to answer an equation. What subject is the boy studying? Yes, the subject is maths. We learn how to add numbers in maths. Now, can you guess what part of his speech is the word math? Very good. It is noun. What about this? Look at the picture carefully. Can you guess the subject? Very good. The subject is science. Selma likes science. She likes to go to the science lab. What is the part of the speech of the word science? Is it a noun or verb? That's correct. The answer is noun. Good job. Look at this picture. They are using the computer. Can you guess the subject? That's correct. The subject is IT. They are using the computer. They are at the IT class. What is the part of speech of the word IT? Correct. It is noun. What about this? Look carefully at the picture. The teacher is using the globe to explain something to the student. Can you guess the subject? That's correct. It is geography. You can learn a lot about countries in geography. What is the part of the speech of the word geography? Correct. It is noun. Pay attention at this picture. What do you think? What is the subject? Very good. It is history. In history, we learn about the past. Can you tell me the part of the speech of the word history? It 
That's correct. The part of his speech is noun. Look at this. Can you guess the subject? Very good. It is English. English subject helps us to speak English easily. Can you tell me the part of speech of the word English? Good job! It is noun. Let's guess the last one. What is the subject? Correct! It is Arabic. I got a full mark at Arabic subject. And what is the part of speech of the word Arabic? Correct, it is noun. Good job, everyone! Now let's have a small challenge. How many words can you remember? Look at each picture, then say the word. Are you ready? Let's start. Look at the first picture. Can you remember the subject? That's correct. It is art. Repeat after me. Art. What about the next one? Can you remember the subject? Excellent. It is PE. Repeat after me. PE. What about the third one? Can you guess the subject? Excellent. It is maths. Repeat after me. Maths. What about the last one? Can you remember the subject? Very good. It is science. Repeat after me. Science. Well done, everyone. I know you could do it. Let's practice more. Are you ready? Grab your workbook and open it at module 2, page 17, and pay attention at activity number 1. In this activity, we are going to look at the pictures and complete the crossword. You are going to use the words from the blue box. Let's read the words together. Art English, History, PE, Maths, Arabic, Science, IT, and Geography. Let's do number one as an example. Look carefully at the picture. Can you tell me the subject? Excellent! It is History. Let's have another example. What about picture three? Can you tell me the subject? Excellent! It is science. Good job! Now, pause the video and try to continue the rest by yourself. Welcome back, everyone. Now, let's check our answers together. Number two is PE. Number four is art. Number five is English. Number six is geography. Number seven is IT. Number eight is Arabic. Number nine is maths. Well done, everyone. I know you could do it. Let's continue. Grab your student book and open it at module two, page 19, and pay attention at activity number two. In this activity, we are going to listen to a song. But before we start listening, look at these pictures. What are they doing? Excellent! The girl in picture A is typing on the computer. In picture B, the boy is doing a science experiment. And in picture C, the boy is standing in a front of wall full of math symbols. Well done! 
Are you ready now for the listening activity? You are going to listen to the song and guess what is this song about? Are you ready? Let's start. 2. Listen and match the verses with the children. What's your favourite subject? I'm good at maths, I'm good at science too, but I'm bad at history and PE too. What about you? What about you? What's your favourite subject? I'm good at history and geography too. I'm also good at maths and art too. What about you? What about you? What's your favourite subject? I'm very good at geography and I'm good at art too. I'm also good at English and IT too. What about you? What about you? What's your favourite subject? Did you know the answer? Did you know what is this song about? That's correct. The song is about school subjects. Well done. Let's practice more. You are going to listen again and match the verses with the children correctly. Pay attention that the song has three verses. Verse 1, verse 2, and verse 3. Listen carefully and match them to their pictures correctly. Are you ready? Let's begin. 2. Listen and match the verses with the children. What's your favourite subject? I'm good at maths, I'm good at science too, but I'm bad at history and PE too. What about you? What about you? What's your favourite subject? I'm good at history and geography too, I'm also good at maths and art too. What about you? What about you? What's your favourite subject? I'm very good at geography and I'm good at art too. I'm also good at English and IT too. What about you? What about you? What's your favourite subject? Now, Let's check our answers together. Picture A matches with verse 3. Picture B matches with verse 1. Picture C matches with verse 2. Well done, everyone! I have a few questions for you. How many subjects have you got in your school? What is your favorite subject? Let me tell you about myself. When I was at grade 4, my favorite subject was English. I enjoyed reading stories. What about you? What is your favorite subject? Don't forget to share your answers with us.